are leaving camp. Got it all packed up. It's 11.13. If you've been watching us for a while, you should know by now, we don't get an early start to anything. But it was cold this morning. We didn't feel like getting up. It's funny, because it's actually probably colder in the Jeep than it was outside. So, you know, we want to stay in our sleeping bags and our blanket, all that. And then you get outside and the sun shines, it's not that bad. So we just left the side road there and we are real close and heading into Natural Bridges National Monument. We made it into Natural Bridges National Monument. The visitor center was closed, but thankfully the restrooms and trash cans were available. So we dropped off yesterday's trash. And, <laughs> and we saw there's a water spigot earlier. They say take no more than five gallons. I'll take four out of courtesy. We're on the scenic drive now for Natural Bridges National Monument. Don't really know what to expect. Like I said, haven't done too much research other than seeing it's on the map and on our way. So, hey, let's look it out. There's a few short hikes. I got a little map and information thing right here. And it's one way right here, so. We don't even have to make decisions. We made it to the first overlook, Sipapu Bridge. I think there's a hike to this one too. Maybe this isn't it, maybe this is just the overlook, but we'll check it out. So apparently, this uh, Sipapu Bridge is the biggest one. So according to this paper we got from the visitor center, it's 220 feet high. And how long does it span? 268 feet. That's crazy. Oh, there. Oh, yeah, it'll be sticky. We're heading back to the Jeep now. <laughs> Gonna see what shows up next. All right, I'm about to start a hike to the Sipapu Bridge. It's a mile total hike. And it is 500 feet of elevation change, so it's gonna just be a steep one out. Angie's gonna wait up in the Jeep because she wasn't feeling the steep hike. She said she'll have sandwiches ready by the time I'm finished. I hope that's true, that'll be awesome. Views are already getting really good. Another overlook of it there. The little trail info that I did read said there was a little staircase I'll be taking and I think I see it. I think there's also a ladder on this trail. There's the stairs. And now we got steps. Stairs, ladders, steps. I think that 500 feet elevation change is starting to settle in on my brain now. All right, we got a sign. Looks like that way, hike down to the bridge. That way to a viewpoint. I'll check out the viewpoint first. All right, this viewpoint, really, really good. It's incredible. Papu Bridge. That's beautiful. Love the fall colors. Okay, I'm heading back to the trail down to the bridge. Excited to see it. Stairs, ladder, steps, switchbacks. Switchback steps, switch steps. Wow, no words for this.
Got a handrail. Going down. Let's go all the way down. Oh, you can. Sweet. So, really fun trail, and while it will be strenuous going back up, nothing crazy. The park service does make it pretty safe with all these guardrails, ladders, and stuff. Sometimes I think the scrambling makes it fun though. Oh wow, under it with the trees. This is awesome. This is like, I don't know, this is like cooler than a uh, hike in arches. Time for the tough hike up. Back to the view area, just down there. So uh, I'm gonna take a small drink of water and get back to the top. Steps, ladders, stairs, all complete. I'm almost to the top. Wow. It's the bridge in there again. I was all the way down there, made it up. Fairly quick. Let's see what time it is. 1.17. Okay. Maybe like 15 minutes, 20 minutes. It said it's an hour hike. And I started at 12.15. It's 1.17. And of course I went back and forth to take videos and then stopped and took videos. You definitely need to spend 15, 20 minutes down below the natural bridge because it's just so beautiful. So yeah. The, they're about right, right on an hour hike. If you're in good shape, you could do it quicker. If you need to take it slower, that's all right. Because it's beautiful pretty much the whole way. You got a cedar mesa up above it. And that cold wind that wasn't so pleasant before I was hiking. Just feels like everything I need now. Might be the bear's ears over there too. I think it is. Oh. I finished. Thank you, I was you. Woo! You didn't start up the awning? <laughs> Our sandwich is done? Yes. Yo! We finished lunch. I'm gonna continue down the loop. I think there's a ruin overlook next. We'll stop there and see that. So we didn't even drive a minute down the road past the Sipapu Bridge. And now we are on the short little trail. It said 0.3 miles and I think that's a round trip to Horse Collar Ruin Overlook. There's the Sipapu Bridge. I'm pretty sure the trail was like over there somewhere. So yeah, we're really close to there. Sign, there's color ruin. Oh, uh, yep. I don't know if the GoPro will pick it up much. But down in there in the shade, you can see it. I'll at least give you a nice view of the canyon here. Just stunning. So we're at the Kachina Bridge overlooking trailhead. We're not gonna do this hike. We'll do the next one. I already forgot the name of that bridge, but I'll let you know later. All right, we are getting here to the overlook. Oh, wow, yes, that is also massive. Right down there. A 
hike down looks like it'd be fun. You'd get some good views, but we'll go see the other one. It's super windy on the top, so. Ready to go back to the Yeah. We're about to start our hike to Owachoma Bridge. It's a half mile hike with 180 feet elevation gain. So not gonna be too crazy, but brought the backpack so we could bring some water. Maybe have a snack down by the bridge. So it's, it's the easiest of the three bridges to view from underneath. The unpaved trail is moderately difficult with sections of bare rock and uneven steps. Oh yeah, look, kind of looks like landscape arch there. Let's go. Gotta stay hydrated. At least these cold nights give us nice cold water for our hikes. Let's go. It was an easy walk down. Let's see how it is going back up. All right, that was Natural Bridges National Monument from our eyes. Really fun, some cool hikes. I'd say it'd be worth coming back even. If you've never heard of it, never been there, and if you wanna go now, hit that thumbs up, subscribe, because we're gonna show you some more cool places. Shouts out to the trash can. Throw your trash in there.